Hey guys, it's your coach, Scotty Hobbs. It's good to be with you guys making a video. I got a tank top on, which means only one thing. My doctor yesterday gave me um, the go ahead to start my workouts again. I, I was not able to work out and it was supposed to be another week, but they said I could get started on my workouts. So I'm extremely pumped about that, but there's been something that's been going through my head, a question I've been getting a lot that I want to share with you guys today because I want you guys to be successful. So I'm going to share things that I've done, that I've learned, that I can help pass forward to you guys. Hopefully the plan is then that you will take that advice, apply it immediately, and then go give that to somebody else. Paying it forward, creating a ripple effect. So I'm going to talk a little bit about personal development books. You guys know I'm on a challenge, on a quest to read 52 personal development books this year. I've also challenged you guys to do that as well. If you're just getting started now, do as many as you can. We're halfway into the year almost. So just get started. That's the most important thing on that. So I've been asked, like, what are the most, what are your favorite top three personal development books or, or what books did you read in the beginning that helped you? So I'm going to give you the books that I read in the beginning and a couple other that I've read along the last three years that have really helped me understand this business um, and, and relationships and helping uh, people. So first of all, the first book I ever read was The Slight Edge. It's going to sound crazy, but... It's by Jeff Olson, The Slight Edge. I listened to it on an MP3 60 times in my first year. So The Slight Edge, number one. Next, 15 Invaluable Laws of Growth. 15 Invaluable Laws of Growth is by John C. Maxwell. Life-changing book. I've seen it change so many of my friends' lives that I'm going to challenge you to read it. And those are my kids screaming upstairs. They're a little sick. So just so you guys know, I live a normal, real life just like all of you guys. So, 15 Laws of Invaluable Growth is the second one. Number three, somebody asked me, how did you go from wanting to make an income of $10,000 a year, bringing your wife home from work, you know, as your big why, to all of a sudden you want to have a six-figure income, you come home from work, and then go on to be in the Millionaire Club. So, what made that shift in, my, in, in your mindset? The shift in my mind that happened right there was a book that I read in my first month as well called, two, two of them, Millionaire Next Door and Think and Grow Rich. Those two books changed my mindset and of what I realized was possible for me because I never thought that was possible for somebody like me until I read those books. So those are the first ones. So uh, I'm going to give you go those ones to start with. So we have The Slight Edge. We have 15 Invaluable Laws of Growth. We have, uh, and make sure you're writing these down, Think and Grow Rich, Millionaire Next Door, and then a couple, a couple other great ones I found out a little bit later by John C. Maxwell were failing forward. That is a must because to be successful, you have to fail every single day. So failing forward. And another one is go for no. Go for no in failing forward. So I hope you wrote those all down. You can always rewind and rewrite those down so that you get that list. And then one that I really want you guys, to, if you're serious about building a Team Beachbody business, you're not just a discount coach, you're not just referring, uh, you don't just have this big goal to refer a couple products once in a while, but you want to create freedom, you want to create a business that, in a model in your business that can be duplicated for years to come to create freedom for your family and to give that blessing to others as well. If you want that to happen, you're going to have to become a pro at network marketing, which is what... Team Beachbody is. It's a network marketing direct sales company. So you have to read a book called Go Pro by Eric War. It's E R I C and then War, W O R R E, I believe. It's called Go Pro. Uh, it teaches you how to be a, net, a professional network marketer. You can be a poser, an amateur, or a professional. And we all go through all of those stages from day one on to moving forward. So listen to GoPro. Just to give you guys an idea, I read it about a year ago and I listened to it three times, three times in the last week. I have the CDs, pop them in my car, listen to them. So you're going to want to get that book without a doubt. So those are some of my recommendations for you guys to start on your personal development journey uh, on believing in yourself and, and learning some skills that will help you in this business. And I will tell you guys that my successful coaches, the successful coaches in the dynasty are not successful because they're sponsored by me or that I'm their mentor. Um, you can consider watching any of these videos a mentor experience. Those coaches on our team that are very successful in this business are successful because they read a ton of books. 
they're increasing the value that they have in themselves, which makes them more value to more people. And when they're valuable to people, people are going to re refer them to people. They're going to have trust. People are going to refer their friends to them. So they're creating value in themselves by reading these books. So I'm challenging you to pick up these books and get started. And don't take two years to read them. Get through those, You should be able to get through all those books in a month or two. That's what you're going to want to do. Hop on the 52 book challenge with us. Uh, I don't have a specific list done, but we, we're hashtagging 52 book challenge on Instagram. You can do it on Facebook as well. You can hashtag on Facebook too. So if you want to look at some books that others have read, you can search the hashtag 52 book challenge on Instagram. There'll be some others from other people, you know, some novels and stuff, but you'll see a lot of personal development books that uh, coaches that are following this with me have done. So I'm challenging you guys to hop on it. There's your book recommendations for today. And uh, remember, it's not going to do any good just to write those down and do nothing about it. It is going to serve you to buy those books, pick them up, and read them, and set a specific goal on how many pages you'll read a day or how many minutes you're going to read a day. If you don't set a goal, you're going to be drifting without a sale. So I'm challenging you guys. Let's go do this. I'm excited to see you guys at Coach Summit. If you're not registered, get your butt registered, okay? Because that is where the magic happens. I want to meet you guys there and I want to be surrounded by positive people like you. So let's go.